This next step is specific to Bluehost hosted websites. If you only have one domain, the new domain will appear as your primary domain within your Bluehost control panel. If you have more than one domain, however, you will need to assign your new domain to your control panel. The way we do this is through the domain menu and then clicking on domain list if it isn't already on screen. Scrolling down, we can see that the diywpipsdemo.com domain is unassigned. Clicking on the unassigned link takes you to an assigned domain screen. We can actually leave the settings as they are using a domain that's already associated with our account, selecting it as an add-on domain so it's added to your primary control panel, and then creating a new directory for all the files with the same name as the domain. If we're happy, we can assign this domain to our account. And when the page refreshes, you can see it's now included as an add-on in your domain list. We've covered web hosting, registering your domain with Bluehost and assigning your domain to your control panel. The next stage is to install WordPress.